Welcome to the Getting Started video for Turnitin Administrators. This video will give you an overview of the Turnitin Administrator's role and the four steps necessary to get instructors set up using Turnitin. The role of the administrator is an important one. The administrator is the point of contact for instructors about Turnitin, serves as a liaison between Turnitin and the institution about important updates and information, manages the account for the institution, and is often responsible for training instructors on how to use Turnitin in their courses. The administrator can get instructors set up using Turnitin in four easy steps. The first step is to activate the institution account. The activation email will come to you from Turnitin. It contains your email address and user password, as well as an account ID and account join password. The email and user password are your personal login to turn it in. You will not share this information. The account ID and account join password are for your instructors to join the institution account themselves. To log in to your user account, type in your email and user password on the Turnitin homepage. This will take you to your administrator homepage, which lists your institution's account. Once you've accessed your home page, the second step is to add instructors. It is preferred that administrators add instructors as a bulk file upload with the instructor's first names, last names, and email addresses. Administrators can upload multiple instructors as a list by clicking on Upload List. The file type can be Microsoft Word, Microsoft Excel, or plain text, and must contain 100 or fewer instructors. The third step is to train instructors and librarians. Many administrators are responsible for training instructors. This is probably one of the most important aspects of the administrator's role to get instructors using the Turnitin tools. If possible, it's recommended to have an initial training session that helps instructors perform three main tasks. Create a user profile, set up a class and assignment, and submit a paper to the assignment. If an initial training session is not possible, Administrators can provide instructors with links to the Getting Started videos, Quick Start Guides and User Manuals, as well as other training videos for instructors and students. Lastly, the fourth step is to keep instructors actively engaged with Turnitin for successful implementation. Continued training sessions on additional tools or added features are helpful for instructors to keep using Turnitin in their courses. Updating instructors about Turnitin webinars, maintenance, etc., as well as important changes to the Turnitin tools are typically the responsibility of the Turnitin administrator. Providing instructors with teaching tips and tools in monthly emails or newsletters can be another useful way to keep instructors actively engaged. For more detailed information for Turnitin administrators, see the Quick Start Guides and User Manuals on the Turnitin training page.